hello there everybody welcome back to more terraria i hate saying that dude you all told me that that's the way that you're supposed to say it it's, it's terraria um i i just i'm i'm sorry <laughs> i'm sorry already uh but it's, it's friggin terraria dude it ain't no terraria bs garbage uh we're gonna make a house today um i have absolutely no idea how i'm gonna do this um i haven't done like any building in this game before uh at least not at you know, a large scale, so I'm a little bit nervous to make a, a house that might look uh, like total poop in the end, but I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try, okay? And we're gonna, we're gonna chat and have a good time while we do it. Hope you guys are enjoying Terraria. Hope you're having a good day today. It's a beautiful day for me, dude. It's like 60, 68, 69, nice and sunny outside. Gonna play some basketball later, hang out outside and just, uh, enjoy the beautiful weather there's something about you know i we i literally i just talked about in a previous video i don't even remember what video it was at this point but i was talking about uh what my favorite what my favorite seasons are and uh i was talking about how how summer's too hot for me occasionally uh and how i enjoy like normally the the cooler fall weather a bit more um this weather right now Oh my god. I, I could live in this weather for friggin' ever. Um, it's just so nice to have, you know, 665 and up and sunny. You know, between 65 and 70, right? Uh, sunshine, blue skies. You can't beat it, dude. You can't beat it. Okay, here's what I'm going for. I'm going for... Basically, I'm, ba I'm making one of my Minecraft houses that I normally make, but in, in Terraria. Is that going to work? I have no idea, to be blunt. Uh, but I normally, you know, you have a, a, a stone base. And then that gets... Did he just fly in on a freaking balloon? You psycho? I think, he, I think he's crazy. I think he's gone mad. Okay. How, how do you... How do I make that look nice and clean, dude? I have no idea how to make that clean. I also just realized I can just straight up replace stuff uh, without it even without it even knowing. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Next step, walls. Okay. There's going to be a nice stone bottom here. I prepared some materials for this, by the way, uh, in case you are... A little bit confused on where I got a bunch of stone walls from and 400 wood. I've been I've been chopping trees off camera and making sure that things are uh, as ready to go as humanly possible to get this beautiful house in. I also I want to build Luke a house too, but I also hate him, so it's not high on my list to make Luke Jack Diddley squat most of the time. Okay, his slime. I don't know if you realize. I'm making a friggin' house, okay? So, if you if you can get the hell out of my way, that would be lovely. Thank you. Sheesh, dude. Uh, okay, let's go. Also, I you told me that these hearts, I just click them in here. And that, that's way easier. Uh, so, I appreciate that. I'm gonna do, like, a rope that goes up from here. I know that right now this looks, this looks absolutely disgusting. Uh, and I, I wholeheartedly agree. But it's gonna, it's gonna come back around. Okay, it's gonna come back around. That's gonna go over like that. I do actually like that staircase like that, but okay, what have I done? I don't like the staircase like this though. Apparently wood is uh broken with a pickaxe, not an axe. Fair enough. Minecraft, what have you taught me in the end? Um Okay. And this comes right over like that. Then what? Then what? Then you extend the wood out a little bit like this, right? And it goes up. It's a little bit weird, right? It's a little weird. And then you maybe even... Now, how... How, how do I turn that into a step? There we go. The hammer does it. I knew there was a way to do that. We, we got it figured out. Okay, then you come over here. And you're basically just going to mirror the exact same thing that you did on the other side. To where it's going to look something like this. Look at this, man. Now, this is a house. This is a freaking house. I think it looks fantastic so far. It obviously is not finished. Needs a little bit more work, but I I think it's gonna, gonna look like a million dollars at the end of this. Okay, so then you come up. Um, we're probably gonna bring the walls up pretty high, right? 
because we need to store all of our stuff. I'm then going to also, once we reach a, uh, a certain height, I'm going to stagger it like off to the side a little bit. Let's also get, get this and this in. Smack those with hammers. Look at this. Why does it feel like it's... I think it's just because we don't have this all the way up with the height that it looks a little off. But we can easily get that put in. Look at this, dude. Look at this. Okay, then we're going to push it. I'm going to do it on this side, actually. We're going to push it out to, like, there. Um, and it's going to come in to, like, here. And then we're going to continue to bring this up. And we're going to have, it's going to be like a wonky roof, right? A little sideways wonky roof. Look, you, you got to bear with me. This is the first time I've done any building uh, in Terraria. Let's let's get some, some ropes up so I can do some work up here. Now, how in the hell am I going to put a roof in? That's a good question. I kind of want to do like, um, so I want to have it come down like this kind of and it's just gonna be squares more or less because i don't know how to make angled angled roofs right so it's gonna come come up like this and just come all the way over as a kind of half roof setup oh this is come on you you gotta be kidding me he's he's a golden god at building in terraria he, he just started how did he get so good how did he get so good and then this comes up to like here, right? And then to be blunt, I kind of want to do like, you know, can I, can I squeeze wood into each of these slots? It appears like I can since I'm doing it. Uh, so that goes just like that. You then got to get another couple pieces here. I actually think this looks good. I think it looks very good. Uh, then the roof here is actually going to slant the other way, right? So we're going to go... I think we're going to go up like one or two more. And then we're going to do this again. Okay? It's going to get dark. I know you guys have complained and been complaining that you can't see uh, whenever I do anything in this game. That is 100% my bad. And I also don't really know how to make it better you guys told me to get a mining helmet but that requires me um getting the person all figured out the the people you have to buy it from something and i i don't know i mean i know how to do it but i don't know how to do it this is not going to be tall enough dude yeah this is not going to be tall enough uh let's let's undo all of this That was, that was close. Get that one. And come back here. Okay. Beautiful. It's good, dude. It's good. Uh, it's just a little dicey, right? We, we, we have to get the... We, we gotta get the angle right on this one to make it really work. Okay. Get rid of that. This has to just come up. This does mean that we're gonna probably replace... Hey, get the hell out of here. Don't you see I'm making a house... Why, why must you invade my personal space, Eye of Cthulhu? Okay. Gonna replace a chunk of those. We're gonna have a nice little <laughs> step stool to get back up. And then we're gonna get it back, back going. Hey, guess what? Guess what, dude? Guess what? Y you like that, huh? You like that? Here, you ready? How, you, how do you like, how do you like that, huh? A little yo-yo to the face? Feels good, doesn't it? And then we're going to bring this down. And I'm just going to commit wherever this goes is going to be good enough for me. It's going to be close. I don't know. It'll probably work. It's going to come right into the corner. I don't need it to be too fancy. Um, we're going to split up the inside into rooms anyway. Yo, this is actually... He's, he's so good, though. Like, he's actually so good. All right. And that's down. Let's probably bring it out like one or two more. Just so we have a nice, nice slope here. And then we'll do the inside in a second. But this is going to come up to here. 
Um, we can also put like a chimney in, but I don't know how to do that. <laughs> I mean, I suppose I could. Oh, you know what? I also I wanted to I wanted to do this on camera. Um, but there is what take fall damage? No. Uh, there is a block. It's like gray brick, right? That I can make from. Yeah, this right here. I kind of wanted to make a chunk of this. That I could then use for parts of the building as well. Um, okay. The nighttime is, is starting to get a little wonky. This is probably when you go, you know what, it's time for a little bit of mining. And you go back inside. Um, I need my spear, dude. I need my freaking spear. The, the, this yo-yo, it, it got the job done for a little bit. Um, but my, my spear is just... It is simply a better weapon for me at the current moment in time. Okay, thank you. Goodbye. Thank you. Goodbye. Oh, sir. Very nice to see you. Okay, thank you. Goodbye. Um, okay. I need to do something whack here. That's not what I wanted to do, to be honest. Okay. So what if we did, like, little gray brick right here? Oh, look at this. Okay, I do need to get rid of the torch on the inside of it. But you bring this up, like so. Oh, this gray brick texture is really nice. And then that's sitting just like that. You could even probably... Ah, oh, you could probably replace this stone with the brick instead. It looks better, dude. It looks better. Okay, we're fine. I'm okay with the stone on the inside, though. Um, You could also... I mean, you could even combine the two, I guess. Go for a little bit of a weirder, weirder vibe. Combine the two together. But I don't know. I, I think that the, the gray brick, it looks good. Um, I don't know. I'll let you guys, you, you'll, you'll tell me, right? You'll tell me if this looks like, looks like ass or not. Um, I think the house itself, I think it's a cute design. Um, it's tough because I, I'm used to building in a 3D space. And then this is obviously not in a 3D space. Um, so I'm not really used to the, the, you know, it's basically like making pixel art, right? Which is something that if you've ever seen my emotes from back in the day, don't let me, don't let me do pixel art because my pixel art looks like trash. Hey, buddy. You want to like just die to my pickaxe? Thanks. Okay. I think this looks fine. I think it looks fine. I do think that, you know, there might be a better way to get up into the house. You know, a rope through the middle is a little bit strange. Um, unless we build around that, we make the rope, like, right here so it goes all the way up. That actually seems way too highly logical for me to not do it, right? And then you just extend that rope down so that's our way in. And then this one we just get rid of. You know, I suppose I could also, like, I do have a hook, so I could just, you know, like, boop, and then I'm in kind of thing. But I don't know. I think in terms of the vibe that I'm going for, I think this looks pretty nice. I think it looks pretty nice. Okay, uh, let's, let's go while we're, while we're nighttime. Let's do a little bit of mining. A little bit of mining never hurt nobody. Uh, it feels good to get some mining in on a beautiful day, right? I also upgraded my axe to an iron axe. Um, I'm gonna be real. I don't think I I even saw a difference when I did it. Um, also, the music is very quiet. I think I turned it down. Yeah, let's let's get that back higher before one of you mentions it in the comment section. Zombie just came on. You know what, dude? I respect your tenacity. Um, I do have to murder you, but I I I have full faith that in the future you are going to be a uh, a strong zombie when you come back to life. How does that work exactly? Not in Terraria, but in, in real life, okay? Zombies, obviously, you, you can tell I haven't seen very many zombie movies. Zombies are obviously, like, they're they're the living undead. So if I kill a zombie, ain't it just gonna come back to life anyway? Like, ain't that the point of zombies? Why do so many video games go for go for the zombie thing? They're just always gonna come back to life. As big brain hours. Why not instead do, like, let's normalize having the main enemy in a game be a werewolf. Right? That way you got something of actual, uh, of actual fear and value. Although I suppose, I mean, the zombie's gonna come back to life. Which is, I mean, that's, that's pretty scary, I suppose. 
Whoa, well, this, speaking of scary, dude. Look at this cave right now. Okay. Thanks for the cobwebs. It's a little dicey down here. Um, we also still have a worm that wants us, like, real bad. But wait! Loot has been here the entire time. Look at this. Oh, baby. Tyler's flailing was finally stopped by explosives, June 16, 2020. Uh, I don't remember dying here, if I'm being perfectly blunt. Um, you might remember me dying here, but I, I don't. Which is very strange. Did I die here? Also, what was that that just dropped? I gotta go get that. That looked like a friggin' first aid kit. Oh, we're, we're in deep trouble now, dude. There's a life crystal down here. Hi, what are you? Arcane depth meter. Oh, what the hell is this thing, dude? There's a weird serpent. I can't see for crap. There's a weird serpent. I don't like it. There's a lot going on over here. Okay, please. He's so good at the game. The hook just makes you feel like a damn superhero all the time. What other mystical creatures do we need to normalize as the main enemies in video games? Uh, thanks for asking. I think that skeletons are a good one, um, but we need to stop making all skeletons archers. I know they're not in Terraria, but uh, many, many games do skeleton archers. Like, they don't even have hands. How the hell are they going to hold a bow? Just have them come at you, preferably with one of their own bones in their hand. And I think that would be significantly cooler uh, than another skeleton archer. I'm looking at you, Minecraft. I'm allowed, I, look, I'm allowed to trash talk Minecraft when I play Terraria, that's the rule. Um, otherwise, it's, you know, it's just unfair. Please. Please. So what do you do here, huh? I mean, look, I think you just, you should finally look at the loot in here. So first of all, um, light up the place since your chandelier went out 20 years ago, I guess. Um, give me the statues. Hammer statue, spear statue. Give me your anvil. Give me this platinum chandelier. Oh, hello. And then this is a flare gun. Okay, that's cool. And 44 flares. Bunch of arrows, healing potions, longer potion, glow sticks, a gold coin. Okay, I mean, this, this flare gun did not appear to be very good. Also, our inventory is friggin' full already. It was not incredible. Also, I can make a mana crystal. Uh, cause I collected those, so let's get that the hell out of our inventory. Feeling good. Feeling real good. Okay. I wanna go... Oh my god. <laughs> this is incredible. That... Don't explode. I don't think it's gonna explode. That's not how a flare gun works. Okay, I do really like this. I'm not sure how useful it is. Also, the flare works underwater, which is, I mean, that's news to me, to be honest. Um, not really how, how it works. Um, but sure, that's, that's a par on, huh? I can also, it does a little bit of damage. That's not terrible, right? Give me this heart. Hi, he's fat boy. Get out of here. Um, a ring of regeneration. Hello. Don't mind if I do. A suspicious looking eye that summons the eye of Cthulhu. All right. Sounds good. Throwing knives, healing potions, gold coins. We've got it friggin' all, dude. Okay, trash this stuff. I do need more chests, so I am gonna I am gonna snag that real quick. A day bloom, what do you take me for? Pile of trash, right? Okay, that jellyfish hurts. So this is, uh, well, I mean, look, if you can shoot flares underwater, there ain't nothing down there. There's barely anything down there. Um, there is a, there is a, a piranha here. Say hello to that. There is a pressure plate trap here. Okay. Dude, it's a little, it's a little scary in this cave. And there's clearly, like... There is stuff to see down here. Okay, there's a couple of traps. Um, I think one of them actually just went off. I'm gonna try and mine. There's some platinum or something here. Right? It won't tell me what the hell I'm mining. So I'm just gonna assume that it's platinum. It's because I don't have the space for it. So it's not picking it up. Okay. 
Um, zombie banner, rotten chunk, blueberries. Too much crap, dude. There's too much crap. Oh, armor. Uh, here we go. Beautiful. Oh, it tells you the depth. Okay. That makes a lot of sense, to be honest. Did I get two of these? Look, we don't, we don't need two of these. Plus 20 mana. Plus three defense. Uh-huh. Okay. I'm going to take the mana. Who cares about the defense? I'm just going to throw that away. Somebody will yell at me for doing that, but I think that's... I think it's fine, to be honest. I think it's real fine. This is silver. Okay. No worries. We're going to go back home in a second, because now I'm... I mean, I got I to gotta put my chandelier in my new house. Hello, wormy. All right. Adios. Look at this. Look at this behemoth of a building. Oh, it's so nice. Okay. Uh, do we need wood walls? Okay, first of all, before we get too ahead of ourselves, I'm going to come over here. I'm going to go stack to nearby chests. Thanks. You can also sort my inventory. Wow, this is, like, really, really convenient. <laughs> okay. Um, then... I mean, I got, like, I got all kinds of crap still, dude. So, chuck those in there. I got so many potions. I also, we can make glass, I believe. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right here. So I'm gonna make a buttload of glass. And then I'm assuming with the glass, yeah, I can make glass walls. Okay, we're gonna need those too. We can also make gray brick wall. Interesting. Um, make some of those. Might as well just finish up our gray brick, right? Um, probably wood walls for, for the rest of the inside of here. 340 of them? That seems... I mean, that seems mildly excessive, to be honest. Life crystal? Thank you. Eventually, the Aya Cthulhu is going to spawn. Um, ideally, I would like to be the one to spawn them. To be perfectly honest. Get stone walls back in here because I would like to replace that. Thanks. And then just get these in here. There, there's probably a better way for us to do some designing with these uh, stone walls. But I don't know. I think this is this is going just fine, right? Can do some manual replaces in some areas. These weird stairs on the side surprisingly gave the building some texture, so I'm... I'm not keen to get rid of them all of a sudden, but I also understand that they hold absolutely zero value uh, doing that in this current position. Dude, I can't believe I made a house that didn't look like total trash. I was actually extremely nervous about this. I was like, man, what if I make a house and it just looks like, looks like a dog pooped? When in reality, this house is, is spicy. It's spicy. I think that you guys are going to look at this and you're going to go, oh, gosh darn it. Tyler figured it out already. Or you're going to look at it and you're going to go, wow, this looks like dog poop. Which would be not the most ideal scenario. So here's my workbench. We are going to split this place up into rooms. Um, but I don't know how I want to do that. Interior decorating look has never been my my greatest thing in, in Minecraft either. But if we do like... You know, this comes across. Right? Get get off of the mine everywhere. Left control. Garbage can mechanic. That's actually really useful. Uh, so then you'd, you'd have to have stairs. Let, let's grab some platforms here. You'd have to have stairs. That come down like this to get up to this room, right? Because you still want the place to look normal. Right? How is this? How is this? There we go. Oh, dude, look at this. Oh, it, it looks amazing. Wow, I could not be happier with how that looks. That looks so good. Okay. Wood walls. Let's get, let's get some more of those real quick. Because we are running dangerously thin on the wood wall action. We know where they are in here. I'm just going to crank. We need primarily wood wall. I don't, I don't mind spending my wood uh, elsewhere here. Aha, uh -huh, he said my wood. Okay, get up here. I'm, I'm happy as can be. Now, I would like to place them in this area as well. 
I'm a little bit mad that I'm not going to be able to place them in that little tiny section, but it's getting the job done. This place does need more texture. Um, so be it, right? So be it. There's not much I can do about that at the current moment in time. I feel like as we as we do some interior decorating, um, place is going to get better, right? Going to get better. We could also do a little lay some some ropes down so we can finish this up up here i will say uh i think the building in this game is significantly uh more tedious than building in a game like minecraft but i won't deny this went fine right built a nice house come on get get that in there get get that up there do a little smackaroo on that rope to get that right there now we have a nice nice place here and we grab grab this chandelier do i want to like i mean i don't know where the hell do you hang a chandelier i would like to know why i can't hang it here does it have to have like a solid block it does okay that makes sense well let's replace that with wood then i mean that looks absolutely terrible right there but Think we'll roll with it for now this is kind of a big empty room here in the middle i mean this is obviously going to be a a smaller room here and then this kind of you got a door right here and then this room probably has like a layer that goes into this top room here right you're you're catching my drift you're going oh tyler i see the design now, how do you get up into this room? It's probably going to be another staircase, if I'm being honest. Um, so it's going to be like, I mean, grab these wood platforms. You go do 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 do, and then you put one there, and you kind of bring them down, just like this. And then they attach to the the weird wall thing that you did earlier. So that goes, that goes, and then you go. Hey, look at this stairs, brother. Stairs in their best of ways. Um, I will say, I absolutely hate when... We, we have like an extra stair in here or something. I absolutely hate when the uh, pieces get broken by the hammer. There's like no way to repair them. Because it ends up just looking like absolute trash. And I'm, I'm not a fan. If, if you know a way to fix that, I will happily... Uh, accept that as, as as something something that i can do because i i just hate it uh then we'll have another platform up here this is where we'll put like i don't know our prisoners right and i kind of just like the rope idea i don't know ropes look bad um which makes them a little bit wonky to have in your design but I think they're the most efficient way to, to travel. So I'm kind of... Oh my god, dude. This guy's putting in the work down here. Thanks for all the friggin' money, brother. What a what a guy. Uh, okay, dude. It's... it's. I mean, it's done, kind of. Uh, we'd have to move everything in here. And then, I mean, as we go, we're going to interior decorate. Uh, we have the zombie banner that I can put down. Look at this. Maybe we, maybe we make this the banner room. Just start hanging the banners in there. Um... But I'll, I'll move everything over. I might do it off camera uh, just to save us a little bit of time for some more exciting things within the video. But these statues, I kind of think here's what I want to do with them. Um, can I make stone platforms? It doesn't really make a lot of sense to be able to, but boy, I would really like to. You can make glass platforms. Oh, dude, we should put a window in. Let's put a window in like right here right like a big window in this oh we could just probably replace um anyway a big window right here oh it just looks fantastic dude it looks so good put another one uh small one in this room it's actually a bigger one than we had in this room we might be able to make this one a, a little bit bigger and then you could even you could even decorate it a little bit, right? You get the the platforms, and you go something like that, 
Okay, maybe not like that. Yeah, right, right on the bottom, dude. I mean, I do have to get rid of these now. And I only have two platforms. I'm, I'm gonna need to do some more trees. But, that, dude, that looks nice, to be honest. A little bit, a little bit wonky, but... I think as a whole, I'm, I'm relatively, uh... I'm relatively happy. I know that I need to do... I just made wood. How did I make wood? I'm very confused. I wanted to make wood wood platforms with all the all the freaking wood I have because I wanna I wanna come over here and, and line line my windows. Clearly, the most important thing to do with your uh, your platforms is to line your windows. We're never gonna use that staircase the way that's uh, way it's intended, but I don't I don't really care. Uh, and then you know what, dude? We made a bunch. How did I just wall jump? Did you see that? That was black as heck. Um, do I still have glass blocks? I do. I kind of want to put a, a window right here. Right? Looks kind of nice. You can maybe even go with the, the glass, uh, wall here too. Just to make it feel like you, you really put glass in, except now it's out the other side and things are a little bit, a little bit whack. But now you got a nice little exterior window. You can also apparently break glass and uh, you ain't got no problems. I don't know, dude. I think that that might be okay, right? You could even put a little, like, pothole window up here. And then, I mean, you already know. Line that crap with a couple of those. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing, for the record. Uh, but it looks good. It looks good. I'm actually very happy with this. Wow, you can hit the chandelier. That's pretty cool. Um... I'm pretty happy with this. I think this place looks awesome. We still have to make a house for for Lucas the Great here. Um, we might just refurbish this into a little house for him. But I like this. It's kind of an old steampunk style. It's a little bit um, interesting. I also think, you know what? Just just because I can. I almost think that up here, you actually want this roof to come down the other side a little bit, right? Like you actually want it to be overlapping a tiny amount. I don't know why my brain doesn't really work in Terraria build. Uh, do you, no, you know what? I take back everything I said. That looks like absolute trash. Um, I don't think that's the move at all so i'm gonna just go back and replace all these blocks until they are no longer there uh because i don't like that at all the fact that i can wall jump i'm friggin mario dude is great maybe just like did we just have it off i don't know that looks bad unless we do like okay hold up and my final thing I'm going to try. What if we bring that like that? So it's just kind of dangling off a tiny amount. That's not terrible, dude. I think I think that actually that works. And then it looks a little bit more realistic in the end. Uh, okay, cool. I'm happy. Uh, please let me know. Let me know any ideas that you might have um, for the house. I would be happy to... Uh, I would be happy to see them. These snow blocks kind of work as smoke out of my chimney dude it looks so good it looks so good i'm actually i like that a lot uh let me know any ideas that you got you know if you want to send pictures of your base or something in the discord uh then feel free to to do so but that's going to do it for this episode beautiful house beautiful house uh and a good amount of caving done as well thanks so much for watching i'll catch you in the next one you have a good rest of your day Bye bye